Hey, DF team, this one is mostly for Alex. I just built an RTX 4090 based system with a 7950X3D and ROG Crosshair wow. X670E Extreme, mother, Extreme Motherboard and wow. five, yes, five M2 Samsung 990 Pros. Wow. It means my GPU runs uh, Gen 4 X8 mode on the PCIe slot, unless I remove one or two uh, M.2 drives to get X16. Is there any actual benefit to doing that, or am I leaving feed performance on the table for extra storage I'll never really need? Thanks for all the explanation. <laughs> um, I would say... I with with Gen four. I don't know if there's saturation yet of Gen four with a forty ninety, and it could be very game yeah. specific. Like it could be like one scene in one game where you start seeing these things. I don't think it's gonna be a big issue. But I also think you did go a little overboard there with the amount of M two drives. Just I don't Sounds know what like you're doing. Ninety pros, no less. Yeah, yeah. Like I don't know what you're doing. Maybe you you have a seventy nine fifty X. So I'm presuming you're doing some sort of. Uh, prosumer uh, stuff on your PC there. You're using it slightly as a workstation. That's what it sounds like if you have a 7950X 3D. Um, but yeah, I don't think you're going to notice a big issue in any games, really. Uh, but also, why not do a little bit of back and forth ten benchmarking in the games you play the most? Uh, and then you'll figure it out. I think maybe in the long run, after the, the 4090, if you ever upgrade your rig in the future and use the same motherboard, uh, maybe then you should consider doing it because future GPUs are going to have more PCIe bandwidth. Um, they're going to use more of it to get up to those higher resolutions and push more data over it. So, But right now, I don't think it's a big deal. Rich? Um I guess the question is, how often are you running your RTX 4090 at like, you know, fully maxed out? Right. Because in my experience, I, you know, when I'm gaming on a 4090, I'm putting a frame rate limit on for consistency. My my screen has got a 120 hertz limit anyway. Often the 4090 isn't being fully maxed out. That's not to say that, you know, I should be using a lesser GPU because, you know, basically it's what the 4090 is doing is delivering complete consistency and performance for most of the time right mm -hmm. um so i think you're probably going to be okay on the uh on the x8 mode probably depending on how you're using your 4090 um yeah as i guess the thing that sort of gives it away at the end is extra storage i'll never really need right <laughs> which is you know if it's if, if your slots are sitting there dormant anyway then maybe you should be considering more bandwidth for the gpu yeah right <laughs> but i love it that's just awesome 